Some are being forced to work without pay. Some have been furloughed. These are they all get the money. They're all going to get the money, and I think they're going to be happy. And I will tell you, and I say it often, many of those people that you're talking about, so humanly the way you express it, but many of those people that you talk about are on my side. I've had so many people. The beautiful thing is, with social media, the world can write to you. And you take a look at social media. So many of those people are saying, it's very hard for me, it's very hard for my family. But, Mr. President, you're doing the right thing. Get it done. I've had so many of them. They're patriots. They love our country. And they want to see it be done. Look, this is just common sense. They want to see it be done correctly. We need a barrier. We have to stop people from coming in the way they come in. And if we don't have it, you can never have border security unless you have a steel barrier, a concrete wall, you can call it whatever you want, but without it, you'll never have, you can have the greatest talent in the world, you will never, ever, in a million years, you will not have border security. Can't happen. Mr. President, what's that? Thrown into the backseat of a car or thrown into a van? I heard thinking of a national emergency. Why didn't you announce it last night and when might you do Because I think we might work a deal, and if we don't, I may go that route. I, I have the absolute right to do national emergency if I want. What's your threshold for when you might make that uh, My threshold will be if I can't make a deal with people that are unreasonable. What's your message to the Republicans who are now on Capitol Hill? Saying oh, I think we have tremendous Republican support. I tell you what, I just spoke to a few of the people in the House. We have tremendous support. The Senate has been incredible. Mitch McConnell has been incredible. He said, if the President's not going to sign it, I'm not going to waste my time. And, I mean, Rob Portman's here, he can tell you, he's very strong on border security. Uh, we have tremendous support in the Senate. We have tremendous support in the House. And by the way, you know, they say, oh, is it true that somebody's, you know, a congressman, he broke away. Okay. Uh, yeah, every once in a while you're going to have that. But you know who else has that? The Democrats have that, too. Because they have their people breaking away, too. You know why? Because they know you need border security. But you don't report that. But the fact is that there is tremendous support. I would know, without support, I would be the first one to know. I may be the last one, too. But there is tremendous support. Right now, if I did something that was foolish, like gave up on border security, the first ones that would hit me are my senators. They'd be angry at me. The second ones would be the House. And the third ones would be, frankly, my base and a lot of Republicans out there and a lot of Democrats that want to see border security. Okay, what else? Any questions? So why not sign the other bills, though, for some of these workers who are paying the government? You think I should do that? Yeah, you, you, no, no, do you think I should do that, John? Well, I mean, it's not for me. I mean, I watch your one-sided reporting. Do you think I should do that? <laughs> hey, John. <laughs> no, seriously, John, do you think I should just sign? Well, no, no, tell me, tell me. John, do you think I should just sign? I'm saying that if you sign that, these workers can start getting paid. Uh, the government. So you would do that if you were in my position. You'd do that. I'm not in your position. I'm asking you if that's something. You I'm would asking do. you. Would you do that if you were in my position? Because I, I, if I, you would do that, you should never be in this position. <laughs> because you'd never get anything done. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.